Another group of people without a roof over their heads are living in Caesar Chavez Park in Barrio Logan. As ABC 10 News anchor Aaron Dickens showed you last week, many of them are migrant children who attend Perkins Elementary. Today he went down to the park again to follow through with how the families are dealing with the challenges of the approaching school year. I have been driving by this park over the last month, and in that time, I have seen the number of tents grow. And right now, there are about 60 tents, and many of the families who live in these tents are from Central and South America. You start school next week, right? Carmen is from Nicaragua. She is living in Cesar Chavez Park with her three daughters. Her kids will attend Perkins Elementary School starting Monday. It is right down the block. Their children. I mean, they come here because they want what's best for their children. And I want to break the cycle of poverty. Fernando Hernandez is the principal. He says with nowhere to turn, the school allows Carmen and her family to use the facilities, like taking showers at the school. Hernandez has also stepped in on their behalf, speaking with the Port of San Diego to make sure they continue to stay at the park. We understand that Governor Newsom has given an order to clear out homeless encampments. We understand that there is political pressure and we are asking that that they wait as long as possible. And he says Harbor Police have been receptive. Hernandez is also reaching out to local nonprofits to try to get the families in the park housing. There are a lot of wonderful people in San Diego and I am hopeful that every single one of these families will find a place to stay. So it's unclear how long these families will be staying here, but I will be following up with them and I will keep you posted. At Cesar Chavez Park, Aaron Dickens, ABC 10 News.